Don't tell YouTube. Hey guys, the girl Jolly said I'm back with another video. Yay! Yep, I'm back. Who missed me? All right, now here I am in the flesh and I know you're looking at me like, who is this girl? Yes, because we haven't seen this face in how long? She's been wearing glasses for how long? But yes, yes, lashes are back. And when I tell you I put makeup on today and I almost did not recognize myself, bitch, okay? But this is a long awaited update, weight loss update weight loss question and answer that I was supposed to do what two months ago child child I'm, I'm running out of excuses just let me know in the comments that you still love me that's all I ask at this point point. and for all of you awesome guys who did not unsubscribe mwah, I love you guys so much because you know I may take a while but she's coming back okay so yesterday we are going to go ahead and get the questions answered and I'm gonna go ahead and get started and then we're gonna talk a little bit about my journey I'm gonna show you guys my body update weight update all that good stuff so let's get started when I tell you I'm scrolling for this that's how long ago I posted these questions but anyway let's go first question is how'd you do it and what's the secret I have a list of videos showing you how I do it and the secret, there is no secret and I hate saying this, but you have to do the work. Diet and exercise, that is how you do it and that's how I did it. Hence why I started in 2015 and what year it is? Oh, okay. Next question, what made you decide to get healthy? Um, PCOS pretty much just made me decide because I thought I was going to die so I decided to get my shit together once and for all. Someone says, why keto? I chose keto to lose the last amount of weight because keto targets the fat. <laughs> targets? Keto targets fat and I definitely want to get the last pounds of fat off my stomach and whatever I could do to just target fat instead of just losing everything and looking like a string bean, I want to do that. And keto has been very effective for doing so. What's your goal? Hmm, this is a good question. My goal, if you've been watching my videos, was the 180s. Currently, I'm 162, and I don't know. I weighed myself four days ago, and I was 162. Um, I'm not weighing myself until May 15th, because as you guys may or may not know, I live in Athens, which is adjacent to Atlanta. Atlanta Carnival's Memorial Weekend. So that's always my goal, to be snatching as much as possible by Memorial Weekend. So I'm not weighing and measuring myself until the 15th. And the goal that I'm trying to currently attain to is 158. Again, I'm 162. I know. I know. I can't believe it either, girl. I can't believe it either. And I want you to know, like, I'm not perfect. I know I don't make a lot of videos because this is really not a weight loss channel. But if you follow me on Snapchat, you will see the struggle. Like, I go up, I go down, I cheat, I don't cheat. Like, this is a journey, okay? And as close as I am to my goal, I'll be like, girl, don't beat yourself up. And I try not to. Next question is, are you currently exercising? Yeah, I exercise daily and trying to get to this goal for Memorial Weekend, girl, she's been exercising on the weekend. And if you a long time video watcher, you know fully damn well, Monday to Friday is my schedule because I said no, she will not be working on the weekend. Last weekend, I worked out Saturday and motherfucking Sunday. You would have seen that if you were on Snap. That's where you can find me, Instagram and Snapchat when I'm not on YouTube. Somebody said, girl, wow. <laughs> Thank you. All right, here's a good question. Someone says, I'm loving your new look, but I'm scared of hanging flesh. Can't afford skin removal surgery. Like I can, girl. And did you have hanging skin after weight loss? I absolutely have hanging skin. Do you see that? And when you see the close-up of my body, you'll see that I have hanging skin on my stomach also. I have some in the top of my thighs next to my Virginia. But based on how big I was, I'm not surprised by that. And when you lose weight, quicker than like most or on any type of diet you tend to have hanging skin so I am just gonna work this skin honey work it but I am getting skin removal surgery now you remember when first of this journey I said I was getting the works tits ass you name it Google breast implant illness and Google all these holes down from silicone mm-mm 
My tits have shrunk. They will stay looking like fried eggs. I'm fine with that because I hate boobs anyway. The only thing that's hurting me is the loss of the ass. But I'm currently working and doing exercises to build it in the gym. So whatever little amount that comes up, I'll be happy with that. So I'll be having the skin removed, a tummy tuck because it's necessary because of how big I was and how much weight I lost and that's it okay and as far as paying I'm considering getting a part-time job to save all the money for it I mean if you guys would like to start a GoFundMe I mean I'm taking any donations okay because she's getting the skin off yes she is what's your motivation to staying fit my motivation is feeling and looking good in clothes for once like I've been fat my entire life when I was in the ninth grade, I was 213 pounds. I've never been in the 100s. I've lost weight before, like maybe eight years ago. I only got to 187 before I met Ray, fell in love, and started eating my ass off, okay? So, I've never been 162. I've never seen the 150s in my body and what it looks like, so... That's what's motivating me, but I can tell you that the diet is getting boring. And when I get bored on a diet, girl, I eat what I want to eat and then I get back on it. The key is consistency, doing the right thing, sparing, cheating, and getting back on the horse once you do. You know what I mean? Next question is, if this hasn't been asked already, how long did it take you to lose the weight? Well, to be honest, drink break. Y'all want to be back, right? To be honest, it's still loading, but I started September 2015. I know that for a fact it was September 2015 because it was a couple of months after I got married. And girl, between us girls and the couple booze, hey booze, um, when I saw my wedding picture, and I'm going to put it up here. When I saw my wedding picture, I was like, bitch, no. No, no. Look at Ray looking all chocolatey and sexy and shit. Look at my fat ass. I was still working it though, but I was definitely big. But that's what made me decide to get myself together. Oh, and what the hell? What the hell changed? There's no way that you can watch the health and go back to eating regular. If you did, leave it in the comments because I want to know who you are. Child, even if you go back to eating certain things, you're just 100% never going to go back. For instance, I 100% never went back to eating eggs. Now, I've had eggs like if you put in a meatloaf or things like that, but cracking an egg and eating it, eating scrambled eggs, she will never, she will never. Cancer, cancer, cancer. All right, that's it for the questions, and I can't be mad because I, they were from New Year's, okay? girl okay but here's what I want to tell you guys I appreciate all the love and support on my weight loss journey it's been hard it's still loading I'm always going to have to eat right and exercise which sucks donkey balls but at the same time I'm so glad that I got here and I'm not in the beginning where I was look at this picture no look at this picture this picture I was what it was 1998 I was probably 20, maybe 20. Look at how big I am. It's been something that's been going on. I, I've never looked like this. Now, let me go ahead and show you guys my body because I know you guys would like an update and I want to show it, to be honest. Here I am, and I definitely apologize if it's a bit blurry. Girl, okay? This is my first video back, y'all. Here I am right here. I'm in my bra and the tights that I'm wearing right now. So you can see everything and everybody. And yes, I know my bra is too big, okay? I have bras that fit me and sexy bras from Savage, all that good stuff, but she's working in these, okay? <laughs> okay. And I'm off today. That's why I made the time to do this. But anyway, as you can see, look at my arms. Look at my body. I have lost a lot of weight and I've trimmed down significantly. Look at my stomach. There's loose skin there. There's loose skin there, sorry. So, it's just something that's on there and I'm accepting it until I can get the money up to have the surgery and more likely it's going to be 2020. But yeah, I am, look at that. Look at that. I am so freaking proud of it. Like, seriously. I'm so proud of it. Like, yes. You see that little booty trying to come in? Okay, I don't care if you don't see it. Get a magnifying glass. I see it. Alright, now as far as eating, I am still keto. 
I am still eating the same thing damn near every day to help me stay true. I am obsessed with sugar-free Hershey's, um, sugar-free Hershey's chocolate chips. They're made for baking. I shovel them in my fucking mouth. Um, that's what I cheat with when I just need chocolate, you know, you know, okay? Um, this week I've been eating like a lemon chicken recipe. Actually, last night, judge me, don't judge me, judge me. I made turkey spam. Yes, the fuck I did because I have loved turkey spam, not fried. I like it in like a tom in like a gravy, okay, like it's an actual meat with onions and mushrooms. Yes, I do the most. I have that with some green beans. That's what I've been eating for. I ate the spam last night, but green beans with cheese on it and um like rotisserie chicken, or I'll make like stuffed peppers or meatloaf. But that's what I've been having with avocado every night so I'm still on keto and I am still fasting I am still one meal a day but I change it slightly I fast Monday to Friday and on the weekends when I'm hungry girl I eat I eat if you follow me on Instagram I do post my fasting I use a zero app sometimes on there and you'll see I go 20 sometimes 24 sometimes 26 without eating only because I'm doing hair all day you know and I just can't get to my food until 9 10 o'clock at night so it's fine with me it's fine with me I do make it and as you can see I'm still on the iced tea with stevia so it's still it's still pretty much the same I'm just steady sorry I'm getting so dry my mouth that still came out wrong. I'm getting so thirsty because I haven't talked like this in so long. So, yeah. That's, that's pretty much the update. I thank you guys so much for caring about my journey, for supporting me, for the encouragement. Like, it does not go unnoticed. I try to comment back to everyone. Um, they, please leave a comment because I'm trying to come back to YouTube and I'm going to need my engagement to go up. So, even if it's just an emoji, can you please leave a comment and like the video? I know I... I told you guys to like it earlier, but I have to remind you guys because I have to remind myself because that counts as engagement too. So in order for me to come back, I got to get my views up and you know, all that stuff. So I'm going to try and I have some things coming up. I pause because I'm like, I need to stop. I'm trying to do this thing where I just show you and not tell you. So there's things coming up. That's all you need to know. I love you guys. You see your girl? Do you see your girl? Hey! I'll see you in the next video.